All right, we want to get back to here, the Magic City Classic here at Legion Field. And we've been talking about the impact of the Classic to the city. Let's talk to Park Board Chairman Montel Morton about what this Classic means to this field, to Legion Field. First of all, happy Classic Arc, and yes. thank you for coming out. The Birmingham Park and Rec is happy to play a role in the largest event in the city of Birmingham, the largest economic event in the city of Birmingham. And it's just a time when family, friends get to come out, tailgate, you know, this is the home of everybody. Legion Field is Birmingham's home. So we're just happy to play a role in the success of the SWAC, um, partnerships with all the local vendors. It's a win-win for everybody, restaurants, hotels. It's, I'm just happy that Birmingham Park and Rec in the city of Birmingham could host this event. But economically, this means a lot to this city. A lot. It averages around 20 to 22 million, if I'm not mistaken. Um, people eat, people drink, people just patronize. It's just, uh, just a way to get back. If you ride up and down Third Avenue, grocery stores, people are shopping. People will be shopping tomorrow. This is our event, and we own it, and we're happy to play a role in it. All around Legion Field right now, you can see crews getting ready, still making the final preparations. What should fans expect when they come out to the game tomorrow afternoon? First of all, everybody should have their masks. You know, let's, let's practice safety first. We'll have sanitized stations all around for safety. Um, crowd control, we're going to be here to try to manage as much as we can, but we need you to play your role. Your role as fans, bring your masks, be respectful of your neighbors, be respectful of the person next to you. Uh, we'll be, everybody will be tailgating, enjoying themselves. But just remember safety. It's not about you. It's about the person next to you. As this is the biggest event in HBCU for all HBCUs across the country, but Legion Field is also in play for something else in terms of football. Yes, the USFL. We will be hosting six games here, practice facilities. Um, the legal team now is just working with their legal team to kind of iron out some of the details. But if you can look back and see, I remember as a kid, Joe Cribs, yeah. um, stout quarterback, family, friends, with my dad. Birmingham has always played a role with football. Look at Antonio Langham intercepting yeah. the ball, running in against Florida. So this is a place that has history. It is, and but today, Magic City Classic. The Magic City Classic right. is here. We got Star Wars, we got the whole nine. That's right. I just, can't, I just can't wake my friends from Huntsville and Montgomery. I'm happy, Art, I'm ecstatic. I just thank you for playing a role. This is a win-win for the city of Birmingham. Montel Morton, the president of the Park Board, talking about the excitement for the Magic City Classic taking place right here at Legion Field tomorrow afternoon. Sherry. All right, I feel all that classic love here in the studio. <laughs> we'll see you at 5 o'clock.